That's right, actor and comedian Tracy Morgan still in critical condition in hospital after that very deadly accident in the New Jersey Turnpike over the weekend. He was uh, in a limo bus that got rear-ended by a semi-truck early Saturday morning. His fellow comedian James McNair died in the crash. Tracy Morgan had surgery yesterday. He has broken ribs, a broken nose, and a broken leg. Now, the driver has been charged with a number of crimes, and uh, Tracy Morgan expected to remain in hospital for several weeks, still in critical condition, but is responsive. In other news, a man was arrested while trying to break into Sandra Bullock's home over the weekend. It happened about 6.30 a.m. yesterday morning, just hours after she had returned home from an awards ceremony. His name is Joshua Corbett, and she has already filed an emergency protective order to keep him from her in the future. But some scary stuff there because she was at home at the time. And the Tony Awards were yesterday honoring the best and brightest in Broadway, and Neil Patrick Harris stole the show. Check it out. There you go, Neil Patrick Harris uh, as Hedwig, Hedwig and the Angry Inch, uh, giving uh, Sting a little love there. But it was a three-hour show hosted by Hugh Jackman, a lot of singing, a lot of dancing, and Neil Patrick Harris along with Brian Cranston both took awards away. And guys, we have to show you this from Friday. Weezer were playing a show in Florida, and their drummer Patrick Wilson caught a frisbee that was thrown into the uh, on stage by a fan and keeps playing. Look at that! Amazing stuff. This video is going viral right now. Gotta love that.